Hi guys. I am doing two looks with the Lime Crime Prelude uh, Chroma palette. Uh, this is what the inside of that palette looks like. It's an eight pan palette. The colors are very, very nice. It comes with a nice size mirror. And I'm gonna do some live swatches for you right now. I love that sea foam color right there. First up is Nymph. And look at that color payoff. It is beautiful. Arrows or E, I think it's E Rose or e Rose, E R O S. Never said I was good at pronouncing things. Sea foam. I'm going to try and darken that one up a little bit. It is a stunning color. And then we have Triumph. And that one is a stunning color as well. And then the last four. Up first is Cypress or Cypress. I think it's, I'm not sure. It's. I've heard it pronounced both ways. And this is a really pretty color. Then we have Saturn. Look at that. Olympia. And Genesis. Again. Here are the swatches from that palette. And then this palette uh, retails for $38. I bought mine at Ulta a while back. I have an announcement during this video. So during the first look, I will have an announcement. And then again, at the end of the video, you may want to watch this in its entirety. And let me go ahead and start you out with look number one. With my Chanel nine, number 19 brush, I am going to go ahead and dip into the shade Saturn. Nice saturation on the brush. And then just lightly tapping it on the outer part of my eyelid. It's a pretty color and I'm quite impressed it's a very pretty color it's very pigmented and I didn't even need to <laughs> double dip with my Delium 777 brush I'm gonna dip into sea foam oh that is so pretty Oh, I'm just putting it um, on my lid uh, and I'm leaving just the last part right there empty for the time being. 
flipping this brush over, I'm going to use the shade Triumph. With my Delium 785 brush, I am going to use the shade Olympia. I'm going to place this above Saturn. I'm going to tone it down just a smidge. With my Lexi 231 brush, I am going into the shade Genesis. Placing this in the outer V. That is a pretty color. It's going on nicely as well. Very, very pretty. Oh, I like that. If you couldn't tell, I like it. Going back to my 785 tapered brush, dipping again into um, Olympia. don't like to have harsh edges so or lines whatever you want to call it with my moda pro 402 brush i am dipping into sea foam going right under the lash line and now I'm gonna go and use my Sigma E30 dipping into Genesis and I'm trying to make sure I get it right at the, the lash line And that was my Urban Decay LSD. Here is the finished look. I went ahead and I lined my upper and lower waterline. I used Urban Decay's 24-7 in the shade LSD. Of course, I used my Estee Lauder Sumptuous Extreme. And where did I put it? 
and I use my Sugar um, Wingman Microliner. It's waterproof and I'll be black and I'm bummed. This one is pretty much kaput. So I know I have an extra one. Anyway, you guys, I hope you enjoyed this look. I have an announcement to make. So, got this one. And I have one to give to somebody. Um, I went ahead and bought an extra one. I liked the color story. And I bought it because, you know, there's not... We're not hearing of very um, good things right now. Uh, we got the pandemic and everything else going on in the United States. And sometimes, you know, we, we take that in and um, just get stressed and it's not good for our health or anything. Anyway, I wanted to do something nice for somebody. And um, I'm going to leave this up for two weeks. And at the end of the video, I'll give you the exact dates. I just want you to put flood my comments with heart emojis. I, again, will reiterate this at the end of the video. Um, I just want to say thank you. And I, I hope that this will make somebody's day better. With my Lexi 231, I'm going to use the shade Cypress. Cypress? Cypress, I believe, is the correct term, but people call it Cypress. I want to place this one in my outer corner area. The outer V. That's a really pretty color. With my Moda Pro 430 brush, I am going to dip into that shade Olympia. I'm using it to uh, blend in Cypress. Make sure that there are no harsh lines. And now with my Moda Pro 466 brush, I want to use the shade Nymph. So I'm just using one side of that brush. And just patting this on the lid. The other side of that brush, I'm going into Triumph. And the inner portion. With my Delium 781 brush, I am going into Sea Foam. I really do love this color. I'm just applying it right where Nymph and Cypress meet. Going back to my Lexi, <clears throat> my Lexi 231. Dip in a little bit more into the cypress. Just wanting to build this up a bit. I'm grabbing some more sea foam. I 
wiped off the excess on my Delium Tools brush, um, deep, dipping into Eros. Eros, I'm not, and that is that pretty gold shade. And just place that right there. I just need a little bit more. <laughs> Going back to my Moda Pro 430, using the shade Olympia. Again, just trying to make sure I don't have any harsh lines and it gets blended in. With my Sigma E30 brush, dipping into Cypress. Cypress, Cypress, I don't know. Placing this under the lash line. Just wiping the excess off on that. <laughs> wiping the excess off, and now I'm going to go into Eros. Eros, I'm not. I recently made a purchase from a brand I've never heard of. It is J. LaRue. I hope I'm saying that correctly. Anyway, I bought some pigments from them. I found them on Instagram. So I am just going to try the white gold that I bought. They were having to sell four of these for $25. I'm trying to show you. Look at that, isn't that stunning? And no, I don't know how to do a little twinkling light, so this is really how it looks. I am going to use my huh, Sigma 4D HD brush. Looks like that. And I don't want to drop this. So, a little bit on the lid. Let's see. Place this one on the inner corner. Oh, it's pretty. Here is the finished look, you guys. I used my sugar uh, wing. I should know this. My sugar wingman waterproof micro liner, and this is in the shade zero one. I'll be black. I picked this up recently. This is a Urban Decay 24-7 Glide-On Eye Pencil. This is in the shade Shock. I think it's really pretty. And it's from that limited edition Wired collection. And these are half price, so I picked up three of the four. But yeah, that's what's on my waterline, and I like it. I think it turned out really nice. And we know I like purple, so. <laughs> and then my mascara today is the Beauty For Real, which I received in one of my subscription boxes in May. And then I went ahead and grabbed my Urban Decay um, lipstick. And this is a Comfort Matte, and this is in 66. And this is from that Born to Run collection. I really do like the lipstick. It's very pretty. So my final thoughts on this Lime Crime Prelude palette. I like it. I think it's very pretty. I will be able to do multiple looks with this. So I think it's worth the money. This palette retails for $38. Like I said, these are beautiful colors. The current events with COVID and riots has really had a negative effect on a lot of people and I just want to brighten up somebody's day. So I did purchase the second one of those. I have a eyeliner on order so you'll get this, an eyeliner, and then a deluxe size mascara. Um, 
Again, that one's coming as well. The rules. There's always rules to get your own prelude palette from Lime Crime. So I don't want any political, anything like that in my comments. The contest will end on June 29th. I will mail this out and I will pay for shipping. Again, there should be a couple more items in there and I will let you know everything. So just make sure you're subscribed to my channel. That's kind of a given. Also, answer one question. So heart emojis. And then will you guys let me know, do you want me to put in my description the products I'm wearing on my face for the day? If I'm doing eye looks, I've not been writing down in the description all the products that I have on on my face. So do you want to know what highlighter and bronzers and foundation I'm using? Um, and also, do you guys go through the whole description? I have one. It's not really, well, it's not an affiliate link, so to speak, but it's for Dellium Tools. Uh, I still have to do a, a brush video, but I reach for my Dellium Tools quite a bit, and I have the Golden Triangle collection. You get 10% off your purchase at Dellium Tools. And I get a $5 um, credit. So that means that when I need to replenish my brushes or if I decide to purchase for a giveaway, and that just adds up a little bit and that helps me with cost. Um, I, on my Instagram, which is mistyjyt2019, I need you to start following me if you aren't already. I will leave a picture of my Prelude palette. I need you to fill my comment section with lots and lots of heart emojis. I also really would appreciate if you guys would jump on to socialblade.com and pull up my profile. Um, it kind of helps them with giving me a better aspect of where I am and how I need to get to where I want to be. It'll take you five minutes or so and I will choose the winner, like I said, June 29th. Heart emojis, tell me in the comments if you even read the description and if you do, do you need me to put down what I'm wearing face makeup wise that day? You guys are so amazing. I just, like I said, I wanna give back. It's not a huge giveaway like last time, but with just everything going on, I wanted to maybe bring a smile to someone's face. So I'm going to wrap this up. I just want to say thank you so much to everybody. You bring smiles to my face and I'm hoping that this will bring a smile to yours. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you have a wonderful week and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys. Much love. Again, dim dim dimping. I'm dimping. I think I look a little yellow. I don't know why my...